It sounds like you're breastfeeding your baby, you're pumping breast milk and feeding it to them in a bottle, but not nursing them or latching them on the breast, but they're still getting the benefits of breast milk and your body's getting the benefits of nursing. So that's great. But you're wondering if this is going to affect your milk supply. Um, no pump is ever going to be as efficient as a baby, meaning a baby will always empty the breast better and um, each time the breast is empty, that's when your body is stimulated to make more milk. So um, a lot of mothers who do nurse their babies on and feed them that way find that when they pump, they don't pump as much milk and, and they're wondering, well, is my baby getting enough to eat? And chances are those babies are, they're just emptying the breast more efficiently. Pumping mothers tend to get caught up in the numbers. It's a numbers game. How much am I pumping? Am I meeting my baby's needs? Because you're actually seeing what's coming out and what's going in. Nursing mothers just nurse, and as long as their baby is showing signs that they're getting enough, then they're not concerned. So more importantly than numbers, look at the signs that will tell you that your baby's getting enough to eat. If your baby is having at least six wet diapers a day and regular bowel movements and overall seems to be happy and healthy and is gaining the appropriate amount of weight as outlined by the pediatrician, then what you're making is enough to meet your baby's needs. One guideline that you can go by is depending on your baby's age, if they're uh, four to six weeks old, then they should probably be drinking about two to three ounces every two to three hours. And then at that point, their tummies start to get a little bit bigger. They can hold more volume. And so they start to eat more volume a little less frequently throughout the day. So instead of two to three ounces every two to three hours, they start to drink three to four ounces every three to four hours. And from then, it's just a gradual increase um, until about six months when most babies at that point are drinking four to six ounces, four to five times a day, and then having a, a larger feeding before bedtime, like even as big as six to eight ounces. So if your baby is following these patterns and seems to be happy and healthy and again is gaining the appropriate amount of weight, then you're doing good. If you have concerns though, talk with your pediatrician and they can decide if any changes need to be made in your baby's feeding regimen. Good luck with everything and if you have more questions for me in the future, please feel free to ask them on our Facebook page at facebook.com forward slash Intermountain Moms and recommend us to your friends and family too.